Got it. Got it. Okay. Let me get behind it. Ready? You pick it up. Go. My mom and dad's house. I'm actually in their neighbor's yard. There, there is some activity here of a mole. I don't know if he is active at the moment, but I stepped on his surface tunnel and I will be checking on it next 15 minutes. But again, I don't have much time, so and that's about it. I'll show you some of its tunnel. So that's what I'm dealing with and I'm just going to check on it and see if he came back and raised up the dirt. Alright man, and it's hot as heck out here too. What's up guys? I'm barely up. <clears throat> so here's, here's the situation. It's Saturday, 3 p.m. I just woke up an hour ago because I work a night shift and my job has been exhausted past two months. I'm exhausted by it. I can't do anything but work. Anyway, overtime is required. I just can't leave. I gotta work until the job's finished. But anyway, uh, so uh, I'm on my way to my parents' house. They're not home, but I'm gonna go uh, look for a mole. I know there is a mole. I couldn't catch it last time. I'm gonna check on that. And it's been about a week, and last time I was checking on it, it was 90 degrees, and now it's 45 degrees. I mean, it's freaking crazy in Missouri here. Well, that's what I'm going to do. Wish me luck. That's the situation. Also, my kids and my wife, they've been out of town camping. I can't even go camping. And they won't be back for another day. So, that's right, the Molinator's a bachelor this weekend. <laughs> Woohoo, he wants to come over. Oh yeah, we can talk moles, you know. Okay, I just got out of the car, and I can see from here that that mole, for the past week, has been super busy. Those are all mole trails. Um, so I'm going to look more closely, check it out, see if he's moving. Oh, what is up, guys? Ah, uh, I have PTO today. Pay time off. It's a Monday. And uh, what time is it? It's about 12.30 in the afternoon. Sorry, I'm not pointing the camera at me. 12.30 in the afternoon and um, I'm gonna go look for a mole. It's freezing out. It's like 40 degrees right now. It's supposed to be high 50 or high 45. I don't know. Whatever. It's freezing out. But I'm gonna go up to this uh, church, go up to my parents' house and see if I can catch a mole that's been over there. Okay. I just stepped out of my car met my parents and about 20 feet into to their yard and I see mole tunnels in their front yard. Oh wow, I mean, and I was here yesterday and uh, I couldn't find the blighter and he sure in a heck took over. Um, I'll get some better pictures of the trails here, but I'm gonna walk really carefully right now to see if I can catch him in action. Holy crap, he even comes up right here. OK, 
Okay, so all those tunnels you see are new. I mean, they're not like clear passage tunnels. They're surface tunnels. So the mole is, you know, dig this is all new territory. So if I would catch him in one of these tunnels, it would be pretty sweet. I would have a really good chance of getting him alive. Because he has nowhere to go. Anyway, I don't see anything moving. And it's freezing out here and very wet. Okay, in my car here. Mola is out there in the yard, but uh, I cannot believe I actually saw it moving. Um, I just told my mom and dad, I'm like, I'm out of here. It's too cold. I don't see the mole moving. I'm going to check one more time. And sure enough, I mean, I, it, it was luck. I just, because it's only in one area, I didn't even see any signs of the mole moving. It just, started pushing up right in front of me I uh, just happened to be looking in the right spot at the right moment whatever but um so I am going to get my tripod and my uh, shovel and I'm gonna try to get him but he's not actually going anywhere he's just going up and down so I don't know what that mole is doing but I'm gonna try to catch it A little blighter, and he's little too. I thought he'd be much bigger. Be tearing up your yard like that. You have that on Zoom or something? A little bit. Oh, maybe you should zoom out. Okay. Ooh. Hey. Still recording? Yep. Let me get close up to that. Man, they're so ugly. Here, hold it. Ah! Don't. Stop. Oh, gosh. All right. Well, thanks for filming that. Okay, it's at it. Got him. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Here we go, baby. Yep. Got the molar. Finally. All right, thanks for uh, being the second cameraman over there. Okay, I've been trying to get this mole blighter for the past hour. He kept pushing the dirt up and down and staying in one spot, basically. And uh, finally he moved a couple feet to my left. And he kept moving and nailed them. But it took about an hour to catch a little blighter. So sweet! Let me get a glove on. Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> Got him! <'em>. Got him! <laughs> Got him! <laughs> Got him! <laughs> these nuts! These, 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 these nuts! Yeah. Okay, well, <clears throat> that was fun. Like I said, it took an hour. But uh, if you're patient, diligent, you could catch a mole. Um, 
It's really cold out here. It went from 90 degrees in one week to, well, a few days ago, to uh, 40, 45 degrees. And it is cold. It's October, October 15th. And um, moles are starting to uh, do their little mole hills and they're going to nest. And they will eat their food that they stored during the summer and the in the springtime, I guess, in their little uh, larder or whatever you want to call it, it's they actually bite the heads off worms and um, store them, and they'll eat them. But they do not hibernate, so they'll always be active, but just not as active to where you see them every day. You know, <laughs> ain't that right, buddy? Okay, gonna go stick him in a, uh, trying to get out of my hand, in a bucket. Don't bite me, he could bite me right now. Cause I just got him. Oh, there we go. Alrighty, I am in the car, I got the mole with me. I'm on my way to relocate the blighter because uh, I caught it alive and I do not kill moles unless it's a freak accident. But, um, a second here. All right, so I got the mole here. He's uh, listening to some good old new wave music, some Italo disco. Yeah, right. The music sucks, man. Anyway, so I'm on my way to relocate it, but I'm gonna stop at my house first. Um, yeah, I think my daughters are home. Oh, great! Now there's construction with the roadblock. Are you here? What are you doing? No volleyball today? You stop! What? It's so annoying! <laughs> what? I'm tired of the stupidness every other day. It's been a month. I just want to clean my It's been a month. I have not caught a mole in over a month. Alright, fine. I was just showing you the mole. I don't I know what it looks like. What's it look like? Can you smell it? Stop! Stop it! I'm gonna kick you. You're a butt. You're a butt. Hole. So you are. You done? Get out. I know you're still there, I'm not stupid. Look, Stop! The cat's worried about you. Ah, you're a butt. You're no fun. You're no fun. Stop! <laughs> Stop it! No! Wait! I don't care! Quit! I can stop. Just it's not funny. I don't even know how you get so many. Ew, ew, it's like the snot's coming out. Yeah. Ugh. Go out. Kiss it. Get out. I want you to take that wooden rack. Stop and put it. Stop. Okay, wait a minute. Wait, I'm with my wife. My two Bye. girls, and uh, they're going to attempt to she pick up to my wife. Don't not now. My wife is going to attempt to pick up a mole. I'm going to show her how to do it. Okay, here you film it. I'm taking it out of the bucket. That's what I'm talking about. No. Oh, that's not hard. What? You didn't right. even pick it up right. 
Just pick it up like that. That's Got all it. I need you to do. I'll do it one more time. Okay, I think I got it. It's, you got it. Got it. Okay. Let me get behind it. Ready? You pick it up. Go. <laughs> you keep messing. Oh, you make it look easy, huh? Oh, it was easy. He makes it look hard. <laughs> <laughs> See, he tried to get me. It likes me. Here, you do it again. It's do it again. Nice butt shot. Butt shot ever. Do it again. Pick him up. Oh my word. Oh, that was. <laughs> oh. Woo! You're all right. You're <laughs> 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 It's all good. Okay, so mom, it, can you try it? No. Come on. No. We can't you try it? Just okay. try it. I'm going inside. No. Okay, so I asked my daughters if they would try to pick up the mole so I could videotape them. But, and, and my wife, my wife volunteered, and, and uh, she's like the only team player. I was shocked. And she just picked it up like a champ, you know? But, uh, I was hoping it would bite her so bad. Uh, anyway, it didn't. So, time to relocate the blighter. <laughs>